Hi, I'm Jim Judak, and welcome to this week's Trend of the Week video. This week's video is Beyond 5%. I feel we ought to run a uh, Star Trek theme song behind us. Maybe we will. Katie? Maybe? <laughs> anyway, here's what's going on right now in the market. So starting on Monday the 9th, uh, the market was looking like it was going up. And then we had comments from Raphael Bostock, who's head of the Atlanta Fed, and Mary Daly, who's head of the San Francisco Fed. And they both started talking about, hey, maybe the Fed is going to have to raise interest rates to a peak of above 5%. And since the market has been saying 5% is going to be the peak, that stopped the rally pretty much straight in its tracks. On Tuesday, uh, continued this theme, Jamie Dimon, the CEO of J.P. Morgan Chase, said, hey, there's about a 50% chance that we'll stop at 5%, but there's a 50% 50 chance that the Fed will need to move to 6%. I think the sense of beyond 5% is going to start percolate, is starting to percolate into the market. I think this will... This will change senses of timing of when the Fed is going to stop uh, raising rates. It's going to take another chunk of value out of valuation. Um, this is not a, not a good recipe for a continuation of the rally. I'm looking for a bottom in this market sometime around the middle of 2023. Uh, this might push it out a little further, but that's still a good place to start looking for a bottom and maybe putting in some buys. Um, but certainly the move from a beyond 5% to a 6% peak uh, is going to make it difficult for this market. So this has been Jim Chuback. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, you, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. That way you get notification of when we do the next one. We're doing about three a week. Uh, you want more, more, more of me, uh, you go to my um, free site. That's chubackpicks.com, three portfolios. Uh, or if you want even more more, I mean, who could have enough of me after all? Um, go to my paid site, that's jubekam.com, and it's got six portfolios. You can find links to those down below. Thanks for watching.